It's story time! <laughs> so, me and Richard... Hello. Hello. Hi, this is Richard. We made this... Wait, really quickly, hello audience. I have been in like three separate videos that all sucked assholes, so this is technically my first. <laughs> yeah, and then the, the other ones just got fucking deleted. Yeah, the I, other I ones, can't... I just showed up high and just whispered the entire time. But... Okay. okay, so... Uh, me and Richard, in the middle of high school, we were obsessed with Red Dead Redemption. Yeah. Well, really quickly, so, sorry to interrupt you, Hunter, but I think there's a necessary historical background for this. We went to high school... Back in 1942. Yeah, back in... back. We're both 58-year-old men. Um, no, so back when we were in high school, in like 2010 through 2014, if you're comfortable with me sharing that... I'm fine. Um, it was really popular to produce meme pages specifically themed after, like, pop culture characters. So there was, like, Lady Rain... There were a bunch of them for, like, uh, Adventure Time. There were a bunch of them for, like, DeviantArt shit and, like, Homestuck. Just taking a popular character, making a page center around them, and not focusing it around that character, but instead just posting memes. Yeah. So now, go on, Hunter. Okay, so during this time, me and Richard were obsessed with the game Red Dead Redemption, the first one, not the second one. And we're like, hey, you know what we should do with our spare time since we're high schoolers and uh, we uh, are bored? We decided to make this page called Mr. Marston, which was based on John Marston from Red Dead 2. And we were posting memes and we we made like what? Like a couple hundred posts or something? Like like not, what, not what the fuck I meant happened? to say like We probably made like ten, ten posts. posts. By the way, this isn't the first meme thing we created. We also no. produced a group called Get This Folks. If you wanna fucking cringe so hard you bleed out of your asshole. We made a group called The Average Gamer. Oh my god, the average yeah. gamer was so uh, fucking And it cringe. lasted for like two weeks until Hunter posted a picture of an <laughs> apple with a hyper-realistic hairy <laughs> cock on it that almost got us expelled from our school, but nobody could ever figure out who posted it. Because we deleted the page almost immediately after. <laughs> so anyways, part I of the reason- like, I'm edgy, I go on 4chan. <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly, because we're, we're both two reformed 4chan users. We don't use it anymore, but God only knows we used it a lot in high school. Oh my God, we took but, pills. Yeah, the reason we were talking about this is because we were thinking <laughs> Hunter just brought it up out of the blue, and I've realized that Mr. Marston is a literally undead page. <laughs> it like, won't we, fucking like, die. After it almost got us suspended, we deleted the average gamer in literal fucking seconds because we were so goddamn scared. But like, Mr. Marston, I know that I'm an admin, Hunter's an admin, I've deleted it at least three times and it's I've still there. I've tried to delete it like four or five times. It is a graveyard that is exclusively populated by people <laughs> from, I, I'm gonna be generous and say second world countries, posting like phishing scams. It's a phishing, it's a phishing <laughs> scam group now. And like auto group scam. Like literally I just got a notification like three days ago where it's like Mr. Abzudali fucking, <laughs> <laughs> fucking uh, subscribe to Mr. Martin, Mr. Marston, see what he, what it's all Mr. about. Mr. Abzudali de de declared a public fatwa that more people need to come on this fucking page and buy his shit. Uh, anyway, uh, it's yeah, still anyways, haunts we're playing, us. Anyways, we're playing Dead Cells. Yeah. <laughs> it still haunts us to this day, but uh, yeah, that's the story of Mr. Marston. Goodbye.